my favorite lines on NBA Jam. Is it the shoes? And as a kid, you think that you could put on a pair of Air Jordans and jump to the moon, but then you become an adult and realize shoes don't make that much of a difference. Or do they? Today we're reviewing the Reebok Legacy lifting shoe for my people doing squats and deadlifts. I'm going to show you the shoe, show you my performance in it, and it starts right now. In time, you will know what it's like to lose. To feel so desperately that you're right, but to fail all the same. Dread it. Run from it. Destiny still What's good, YouTube? You're in the building with y'all knowing and loving y'all, feeling, seeing y'all powerful. It's damn all everything, the sex is hell host. We're doing reviews on this channel. We review shoes, we review your baby mama, we review your baby mama's stinky underwear, we review tech, cord cutting, everything. If you have a review request, go over to the Facebook Life Games page, leave me a message, I'll try to get it done for you. Also, if you like reviews, subscribe to this channel, click the notification bell. So let's jump right on into these shoes, but first, let me put on these plus seven glasses of the sexy as hell. Work on skill in my craft, giving you a more informed experience, something better to look at. In my hand, I hold the Reebok Legacy lifting shoe that they sent to my door to do a review because they heard me on one of my fitness videos talking about how tight my groin is. I have issues getting low into the squat. And what you're gonna be seeing coming across the screen is me actually squatting in these shoes with 315 versus me squatting with my old Nike Flywires that didn't have a heel. So why is a heel good? And this heel is three quarter inches, get you high off the ground. If you don't have good flexibility, you have tight groin, elevating your foot a little bit allows you to sink down in the hole a little more. And by got to be more careful. Boy, these shoes helped me get in the hole. So let's talk about aspects of the shoe. So first of all, this is a heavy ass shoe. Look at that bottom. You could probably pick up a ton and you ain't gonna crack this bottom. This is not some plastic. Listen to this. This shoe weighs about 20 ounces. You ain't gonna be able to use this shoe for crossfitting because you might can do your deadlifts, your snatches in it, but when it's time to run, you ain't running nowhere with this concrete shit on your feet. You can forget it. It is great for lifting. And when you compare these shoes to some of the other ones, like the Romero um, that Nike makes and all that, this one fits your foot pretty good. And you can see it's got these two little straps on them. And sometimes when you get shoes with straps, this part comes off. On this one, it is like Velcroed in there. When I did my lifting, I didn't even strap them up. And I have a wide foot. And so if you're gonna buy this thing or you're gonna order it offline, I would highly recommend that if you wear like a 13, you wanna go down a size to like 12 and a half. If you wear a 12, you wanna go down to an 11 and a half. So you, your foot is not, you don't got too much space in your foot that you're sliding down. And I got a big foot, like I said, I wear a 12, so I got 11 and a half in the shoe and it fit perfect because I read the reviews of what they was talking about. Now I'm going to show you guys the clip of me doing my set of five reps. You see how the shoe did for me and then we'll come back and finish this video. Alright, let's get five. Alright. Alright, let's get That was me getting down there, man, and the shoe definitely helped me get a little lower. I would definitely say if you're having problems with your squat, if you're having problems with your deadlift, and you never ever thought about a lifting shoe, definitely consider this lifting shoe. My link is all in the video description if you wanna check this shoe out. Um, it'll do you right. I'm glad I got it. I, didn't, I knew 
that I had the groin issues, but I didn't know that a shoe could really help me get lower, and it did, so this shoe comes highly recommended by me to you if you decide that a lifting shoe can help you get low into that squat so you can keep making those life gains. That's gonna do it for this video. Don't forget to like my video, comment and subscribe. Go get yourself a life game. If you're gonna get these, check my Amazon link. It is in the video description. And until the next sex is hell video, I'll see you.